What's going on guys? Welcome back to Arcway, a new direction of a modern man. My name is Tulu, and this video I'm gonna be style breaking down Lewis Hamilton's style. He's known around the world for his phenomenal race car driving. At the same time, his style is crazy as well. So today I'm gonna be breaking down three characteristic points that you guys can grab from this video and apply it into your own style to elevate your game to the next level. Let's go. So if you guys are new to this channel, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe down to the channel and share the content. So the first point I wanna dive in with Lewis Hamilton is that he is a very flashy guy. So within his profession, you don't really see him while he's race car driving. You only see the outer body of the automotive. So when it comes down to him being in public, talking with the media, doing interviews, this is where he shows his personality. I noticed that he really likes to wear jackets. So jackets is a great self-expression for someone who wants to explore many things and maybe it's just the climate as well, living in London, that it is a lot more colder. So you do have to layer up naturally. So this jacket right here is quite interesting to me and it's a Dolce Gambana uh, jacket and it's like a nice blue jazz type of old school feel to it. So if you look at it right now, he looks like he's coming out of a casual environment where he's just wearing this nice varsity jacket, this nice tonality blue and the white and he has the nice trousers, cropped pair of pants and also he has the loafers as well. So this is a nice look um, and this is like a nice, you know, a weekend type of look and it says he's actually in Milan fashion week he was actually spotted wearing this jacket so this is something that he really likes within jackets and I do recommend you guys to explore what you do like specifically within fashion if you do like jackets if you do like sweaters definitely explore more into those into those sections and see what you can find dig up some pieces that kind of make it your own make it unique so here's an example of another jacket he likes to wear it's a nice light blue it is a windbreaker so this is just another style another representation of what you can do with your fashion and how you can elevate it to the next level so the great thing about this is the contrast i think the contrast is perfect especially when it comes down to like a stone brick in the background but also his pants so having that contrast between a light tone and a dark tone is a great staple when it comes down to your outfit so if you want to contrast a little better always keep that in mind mix your lights with the darks and it'll be able to stand out a lot more so in this photo right here he's at a ball mains menswear event the fall winter fashion of 2017 so this one's quite interesting because he has the jean jacket type of look but also it has a lot of emblems and um, different ornaments over it this is kind of interesting because it kind of translates to uh, memphis depay where he actually has a lot of different styles similar to this and if you guys want to see that video look at the tab right there but it's similar styles this is a great look for him at the same time this is something that he likes to wear and it represents him pretty well as you look more into the winter you can see him wearing a different style styles of coats and this coat is quite interesting and even after the design is quite unique so he's wearing overtone brown coat with a contrast of the red and this is actually great because the whole look of it is unique at the same time the design is what is like the eye candy of the whole outfit so it's great to see him in a different style and different look and this is great for the winter time at the same time keeps you warm and especially when you do travel abroad this is something that you should pack the next segment I want to talk about with Lewis Hamilton is that his suit game is insane so when it comes down to his suit game he has all different types of colors of suits and different types of textures and tonalities so when it comes down to his personality he likes to express himself through different types of clothing not just colors in this photo you actually see him wearing this green velvet suit and this is actually a great type of look you don't really see it often where someone wears glasses with a bow tie but someone who has their own personal style will definitely put a spin to it and add more of their personality onto something that's basic and it's actually a great look and how he stunts it is is phenomenal here's another look a few years later at the meta gala same event as before but this time he's wearing something a little bit more like a zigzaggy suit. And this is definitely an eye catcher right here. So as you see, he has a bandana up on his hair there. So it's a little different style. He's rocking there from before. At the same time, the zigzag of the suit is quite traditional when it comes into almost like the Japanese style of suits where it's kind of the traditional orientation of where it kind of folds up to the top here and it kind of has a staple going all the way down and um, it's quite cool and interesting. It's quite nice to see something different when 
you have to be in an environment that's so basic. And this is a perfect place to showcase that because at these type of events, it's meant to stand out. It's meant to show who has the best outfit or represents their own personal style a lot more. And this is just the emblem of what he does the best. This outfit is a little more toned down. It's a little more subtle. He has the navy blue uh, blazer and it's more of like a silk with a bow tie. And this is nice because not only matches with the pants, but he has a nice shoe that is actually kind of offsetting off the whole outfit. So yet again, it's still eye catching and still to his personality but he's staying true to himself. So it's great that he's wearing something subtle in this picture, but he adds a little more personality with it with the different style of shoe. Cause typically someone can go with a black shoe, but at the same time, if it's not you, then it's not you. So it's nice to see him wearing this three piece and it is by Dolce & Gabbana. So it is a nice tuxedo ocean blue. And this is something that I honestly would recommend someone who wants to explore more into suits and tuxedos get involved with investing into quality because quality will last you a lifetime so this suit is actually quite interesting itself people reference this as the dr evil suit but this suit is actually pretty tight as you can look at it right now comparing with the dr evil suit you can see where the similarities come from but this is actually a nice suit where he has won an award um, for his achievements, but at the same time, in these type of settings, they would typically tell you, you have to dress a certain way, but he came in his own fashion, and this is what represents him the best. And having like a navy, sorry, having like a baby blue suit, at this type of event, it just stands out. It adds the icing on the cake. And this is what's great about style because it, it's about styling yourself and being yourself within the process. And that's something he masters really, really well. Next segment I want to talk about is luxury streetwear. So Lewis Hamilton wears tons of this because that's just who he is and that's how he likes to represent himself in a casual setting. Um, it's always nice to have a relaxed feel, a relaxed street look and feels feel comfortable with what you wear. Luxury streetwear to me is more or less about being exclusive with pieces that could be general for the general public. So in that segment right there, it's about having pieces that are exclusive and pieces that no one really has. It kind of creates that trilogy of where did you get that question. You want to invest yourself into luxury streetwear that you guys feel that will last long. And at the same time, I'll provide you guys some links so you guys can check out some companies that you guys may like. Yet again, guys, thank you guys for watching Arcway, a new direction of modern man. My name is Tulu. And if you guys enjoyed this video of me style breaking down Lewis Hamilton, let me know in the comment section down below. Let me know what you guys like about this video. At the same time, subscribe down to the channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. And thank you guys for watching Arcway yet again. My name is Tulu, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.